Also welcome back guys my name is Amlan and in today's make launch free campaign we go about looking at how we can fix the issue of apps getting crashed on android now this may happen on your phone that suddenly your app stops working it may be facebook it may be whatsapp it may be something else the way you can fix this is by heading towards settings and tracking that particular app so you need to go to a zap and uh tap that particular app So once you have this particular app, the details opened up like this inside settings. Require to force stop it. So simply force stop the app, and then also head towards storage. Like after force stopping, you can again just restart the app. I think it should get solved. If it doesn't get solved, go to storage, clear the cache, and then clear the data. Well, once you do this, what happens is is as good as the app is newly being presented in your phone. so this should work but often times what happens is the apps with their versions may not really be suited to the current android environment so in that case what i will suggest is just go ahead and like install the app again so like you go to 99 acres see this is the app simply go ahead and first like you know uninstall the app and then like go ahead and then again reinstall the app so this should like have the app with the latest version often people comment that having the most updated version of the app really helps the app perform well because the most updated uh, app would really count in for all the latest android changes so here i am just downloading the app well once you do this i think it should start working even if it doesn't work now what you can do is you can go towards apps and here search for something called as android system view so we'll just see that system so there you can see android system web view so here like inside android system web view what i will request you to do is uninstall updates just simply uninstall updates and it says replace the app with the factory version all data will be removed this that don't worry it's perfectly fine like once you do this then go ahead and also like uh, like you can decide to disable this in case like this still doesn't work but once you do this things should start working one small request that i also have here is like you know often times this happen because there is certain update issue so update your phone to the latest version also see if you can delete some of the unwanted apps because many of the apps really require a lot of system resources so if you think you have few many apps which really don't need to be there go ahead and delete this so that you have some space available the best way to make space available is also by deleting the videos in your gallery because they can consume a lot of space so go ahead and do that like make some space available on your phone so that like the apps can work without like your system resources being hurt so hopefully this should all work if it all fails what you can do is simply reboot the phone after doing all the changes and it should work will really not suggest doing a factory reset because i think that doing all what i have suggested right now should make the phone work pretty well so now like after the phone has restarted you can just go ahead and check like everything is working or not and i think it should all work very well so like force stopping deleting the cache and the data uninstalling and then reinstalling the app with the latest update and then also uninstalling updates from system web overview i think all of this should work and like having a, a mobile with a lot of storage freely available should make your apps work without crashes if it happen once in a while you may start thinking of it as a server issue but doing all the steps that we have recommended today should make your apps work perfectly fine in case you find the tutorial helpful consider subscribing to the channel click on the bell icon for notifications and do share this with your friends and family i think they should find it helpful thank you